Here's a little scenario I'd like to offer you. In it, you're the captain of a ship. You're brave and true. And you'll be in command of the course and of the crew. But first, let me share a navigational tip with you. If on your voyage you set a course but you're off just one degree, will you make the port of call across the deep blue sea? Or will you find a lonely place on some far distant shore and realize a small mistake was at your problem's core? Just one degree in 360 doesn't seem an awful lot unless you want to end your voyage at some prearranged spot. You see, my friend, just one degree in crossing oceans wide could make you a poor lost soul or a triumphant guide. And yes, there is a price we pay when we are not precise. It makes our chance of life's success like the rolling of the dice. And sloppiness in thought and deed might not seem so awfully wrong unless you want to end life's voyage spiritually sound and strong. In the book of Alma 57:21. We read about Helaman and 2,000 of his sons. Now they survived the battle because of what their mothers taught. They didn't doubt and they obeyed the orders that they got. And when the conflict ended, all 2,000 were alive. They followed with exactness, not one single warrior died. You see, my friend, just one degree when crossing oceans wide could make you a poor lost soul or a triumphant guide. So here friend, take the wheel, set the course, it's up to you. But realize before you start what one degree can do. Will you with exactness be obedient and true and steer the straight and narrow course until your voyage is through?